my everybody. I just finished doing a bit of exercise. Just 10 minutes. Oh yeah, okay, let me explain. So you know I showed you this machine. Really cool machine, really fun. But I stopped since I injured my ankles. But now I'm doing much better. So, so I just did just 10 minutes. 10 minutes of that in like the lowest setting. So it's not even that hard. But since I am so rusty, it was so difficult. One minute, 40 uh, seconds in, I was already struggling so bad because I was feeling like pain here and, and like here. And it was just like, uh, I don't know how I'm going to do 10 minutes. But you know what? We did it. Yeah. <laughs> it's a shame to have to wear out clothes. Um, because I'm just going to get them sticky. Now I'm going to cool off and take a shower. I don't like taking a shower straight after exercising. Drastic changes in temperature, at least to me, do quite a bit of damage. Hi, I just took a shower. That was really, really nice. I had already, not forgotten, but I just like remembered that post exercise showers are the best. They're so nice. I'm so glad I'm back on track. Like I said previously, I live a bit of a sedentary lifestyle, even more that I'm here now and I rarely go out. And also <laughs> because I feel like like my abs are gone. Okay, so context. About a year ago, I decided to do a little bit of an experiment. So the question was, how long would it take me to get the noticeable abs? So how long do you think it took me? I'm gonna give you three options. Option one, uh, three weeks. Two, a month and a half. And three, three months. How long do you think it took me? If you chose number two, you would be correct. So that was very nice and I remember the experiment was over, right? I figured it was a month and a half-ish and then I said, you know what? I want to continue because this is quite nice. So I want to maintain them. My whole workout journey actually started because my health was terrible during the pandemic. I had lost a considerable amount of weight due to depression pretty much. I was really, really sad. I was in Norway at the time. I couldn't come back here, so I stayed uh, six months. So I had to take responsibility, you know, for my actions and take better care of myself. So that's why I have decided, I decided to exercise because I wanted my health to improve, my heart to feel better. I used to have like heart things and my stomach was bad. So it was a whole thing that progressively got better. And I'm thankful for uh, my mother and my friends and my partner, of course, who were there for me to tell me how much they want to see me get better. Support, family and su support is just incredible. So thank you. Okay, I've rambled too long. I have to get to work soon. So see you later. Hello, everybody. I just made myself a list. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. Yeah. <laughs> a list of dailies for me. So things I would like to achieve every day. So we have... Duolingo Norwegian. Rest stretches. Rest strengthening. I have started to do 10 minutes of cardio daily. I mean, I just started today. Those 10 minutes are going to become 15 and then 20 and then 30. I know it's happened in the past. Then I also want to do weight training. Not too hardcore, of course, uh, but I was thinking of dividing the training into this. <laughs> So every Monday I do arms, then legs, then some kind of yoga, flexi oh, flexibility, then arm, and then everything again. And on Sunday I just rest. Sometimes I feel like doing things on Sunday, but I don't have to. Oh yeah, and I added something like research, a new topic. I don't know, I feel like if even if you learn something tiny every day, it adds up. So today's topic, which is not really research, I haven't done any research, but I was looking at gymnastics. Not only artistic gymnastics, which is the one I usually preferred and I, the one I went for when I was a kid, but I was looking for rhythmic gymnastics as well. And it's so gorgeous. It's lovely. So artistic and nice. And the balance and the elements is just so, so incredible. <laughs> Pero ¿y cómo le digo? Por la chuta que lo parió. Se va para otro lado. Tú eres el arco iris. Tú eres el. Yes, I'm the rainbow. Ya, espera, espera, espera. Have to click. Ay, ya, jode, jode, te mira, jode, te mira. Please don't curse on my channel. Chupere, chupere, chupere. Fa, me da. Chupere, muere, muere, cojuda. Te tenemos que matarlo todos. Ven, ven. Yo creo que estoy haciendo algo y no estoy haciendo nada. Por eso te digo, yo no sé qué voy a hacer, yo no quiero morir. Ay, qué cosa tan fea. 
Mira, 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 te está vomitando. ¡Está vomitando! ¡Está vomitando! She's just throwing water. Bueno, no le voy a decir que Hijo de la puta. Jura. Mamá, en serio, yo dije de Lizuyar tanto. Pero yo no estoy listo y nadie me escucha. I am filming. Ah, chuta. Ya, yo quiero que muera, yo quiero que muera. De todos tenemos que matar. Ay, ay, ayuden, ayuden todos. Todos. Okay. Es muy temprano, ¿no? Porque la mayoría de la gente juega en la noche, ¿no? Bueno, mira. How do you know that? Porque ayer había más gente, pues, porque ayer más la atacábamos. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, Pero tú que ganaste algo. Yo quiero que ganes cosas. Oh, she's almost dead. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Lo matamos. Lo matamos o se 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 el culo. Are you gonna los... talk to people? No, 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 no quiero. Solamente digo, bravo, chicos. Ya, okay. buena. Ahora vamos a la hall. Let's go to the hall. She knows yeah. everything. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Thank yeah. you. Hello, everybody. It's the next day. Today is June second. And oh my god, I'm sorry I didn't mention it in the previous clips, but happy Pride <laughs> Month! Yay! <laughs> I hope you all had a lovely Pride time. Uh, but even though it's just one month a year, we should all feel proud and happy all year round. Today is Friday, which means super happy happy. And later today I am going to meet my co-workers. We are having a lunch together. Hello everybody, we're ready to go. This is my outfit. Um, it's very casual as you can see. Because I left 95% of my f fan fancy clothes in Norway. Ah, but it's okay. Hello, I forgot to report everything. So um, this is the aftermath of what we had. And there's dessert, and everyone is here, and uh, it's been very, very lovely being together. As you can see, it is very, uh, how do you call it, a foggy? Like it's not sunny, and I am very glad about that, because sun, kind of annoying to be honest. <laughs> do you hear that? I have some pictures with Jakob here from 2018 Was it? Ah, it's been so long But the memories still remain Also sorry about the wind Hello, I'm back! Hi Kimi! And I'm back into my pajamas, <laughs> yay! <laughs> so tiring having to wear, you know, real clothes <laughs> Yeah, just I just randomly want to share that I'm watching Naruto I am now close to episode 200. Rossi and I wish you an amazing rest of your day. Thank you very much for watching us today. And remember, life is amazing and you deserve the best. We will see you in the next one. Bye bye! <laughs>